We're inside at Info Station Stadium right now. It's around 7 a.m. and you're probably thinking, why in the world are we actually here? Well, I'll tell you why. We're actually going to give you an inside look of what Ohio's Pride, the University of Akron Marching Band, does on a game day. Everyone's tired. It's really early in the morning. What do you do? Well, despite the fact that everyone's tired, it's that slap happy early morning, yeah, energy. This is the earliest practice that we've had so far, and we're already excited and ready to go. The best thing I can just think to do is to provide the biggest, highest energy possible. In between the 50 and, and the 40 on side one, you guys need to push that back a little bit further. Up, and D1. At the end of every single rehearsal, however, they do something that's really cool and something really cool with tradition. Alright, nothing but the best today, guys. Now, wherever the team is, let them hear you. Ready? Akron! Akron! What exactly goes into the whole process? Like, how many sets of drill do people actually have to learn for like pregame or halftime? For pregame, it's 55 sets of drill, and that means that there's a different picture every eight counts uh, in several sequences. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure the fans are probably aware that we spell the block A. All of this stuff I chart first by hand, uh, shorthand. So it's it, the movement has to be designed first before you actually put it on the program. And so we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's an expectation because this is what they're used to seeing. I'm not sure that they're aware of what the process is. band is about to march off and head over to the stadium and they're about to do Zips Fest, one of the big things they do and try to rally all the troops together. Right before you're about to step off, the whistle's about to blow, like what's going through your mind usually? A little bit of anxiousness. Like you're excited, but you're also like, ah, don't don't mess up. <laughs> it's it's kind of like a mind game you kind of get yourself into. It's a lot of times you necessarily may want to be somewhere else. You're kind of tired. You're you got other things to do. It's the weekend, but once you get over here, you got to get in that mindset of I got to be here. I got to do my best. Let's get out there and let's play our best for not only ourselves but for the audience and try to get the team going. just got underway. The game is happening with Jennifer Miranda. Are you tired yet? No. No, no. not at all. No. So you're getting excited for the halftime show. Very. it's all about. Are you getting any nervous at all or what are you feeling right now? I'm feeling really excited actually. We worked really hard this weekend. It's going to be amazing. Good afternoon, Ziv Span. Welcome to the Info Station Stadium. Stay here for another performance by your 2012 edition of Ohio Pride, your University of Akron marching band. We're 
inside Info Station Stadium at Sumer Field, and we're actually doing a traveling band, which is pretty new to the University of Akron marching band. Go ahead and clap. It's all right. Here we go. One, two, and with me, ready, and yeah! What goes through your mind every single game day when you see this band perform? Well, I mean, what I understand about it is we're an integral part of the game day atmosphere. And uh, without the band, it would be just like if we didn't have a football team here. Yeah. 